that's been working for years involves the bad guys walking through hotels, slipping flyers under the doors for a nearby pizza place or a fake room service menu. So why would you question that, right? When you call the number, they'll take your order and your credit card information. But there's no pizza place or room service, just a crook on the other end of the line who's going to take your credit card info and use it as fast as they can before you realize, hey, where's my pizza anyway? The experts at Scamicide say a good rule to follow is never trust a flyer under the door at the hotel. You can also Google the name of the pizza place and see if it's real and if the phone number matches. As for room service, well, you should be able to call them with the button on your room phone, not a flyer slid under your door. Here's another one you don't want to sleep on, literally. Say it's 3 a.m., you're in a deep sleep in your hotel, and the front desk calls your room phone. They say, we're sorry, we've had a problem with your room payment, and we need to run your card again. Well, would you grab your wallet, half asleep, and read them the card information, or snap out of your days and realize it's a scammer calling your room from outside the building. This one is called the fake front desk scam and it's just another way for crooks to trick you into reading your credit card information over the phone. They're hoping to catch you half asleep with this one in the middle of the night. According to the watchdogs at Trend Micro, the best way to handle that call is to hang up and call the front desk back directly. There's a good bet they won't know what you're talking about. Or you can just say, I'll come down to the front desk at a reasonable hour in the morning and handle it in person.